Grand Junction High School is making other news today with its class of 2020. After uncertainty stemming from the COVID-19 pandemic, Grand Junction High School seniors were finally able to turn their tassels at Saplesio Field this morning. Carry X5 Shelby Bracho spoke with members of the graduating class to hear how they feel about this delayed celebration. Go 2020, congratulations everyone. Grand Junction High School hosted its 2020 graduation ceremony. We kind of came to terms with the fact that it wasn't going to happen, so it was a nice surprise that we got to do it. But things were a little different this year. We're missing some people. I have a lot of friends that aren't here today. I'm pretty excited. It's kind of weird because we're two months from where we should have been, but it is what it is. We've never done one like this before with barely any family being allowed to come and social distancing and masks, especially in the heat. Masks were encouraged, social distancing was implemented, and each graduate was only allowed four guests. My mom, my dad, my little brother, and my grandma. My whole family is able to come, so I'm excited that they get to see that I'm graduating. It was really stressful on our whole family to decide who to pick and choose that was able to come. Despite the changes, I think that the risk to reward benefit is there if restaurants and bars can be open and, and there is one open in town. I'm glad that they decided to go forth with graduation and I'm glad we have the right precautions as well. I would have been more upset about it not happening. The fact that we do get to celebrate is pretty cool and we still get to have all our grad parties and all that. Certainly a memorable ceremony. It's not quite the same but it's better than nothing so I'm looking forward to it overall. I am excited. It's going to be a lot of fun to walk across the stage and to celebrate with my class. During an even more memorable year. I think I'll forget a lot less moments than other generations have with my graduation and with my senior year just because of the coronavirus making everything so special and different. First on the Western Slope, Shelby Bracho, KREX 5 News. Now graduation ceremonies will continue tonight at Saplesio Field with Fruita Monument High School students walking at 8 p.m. and Grand River Academy and R5 High School will host graduations on Monday at 8, 8, 8 a.m. and 8 p.m. respectively. For more detailed invest information, visit westernslopenow.com and congrats to all the grads this year.